Whew. Man. I come outside every morning just to check on my plants, you know. Just to observe for real. And then I, I, I felt inspired when I looked at my bean bush. So I did some heavy harvesting. And plus, I've been going through them beans. So we, was, we fresh out right now. This is harvest number. I don't even know what number. But yeah, that's, that's a lot. That's a lot. Just feed two households with that. And it's still mad beans, and I'm just like, yo, I'm done. Well, they were too small anyway for me to harvest. But, whew, this is really a workout. This shit will really work you out. But it's very therapeutic, I must say. Very therapeutic. I love coming out here and getting me some beans off the tree. I would eat this one, but it seemed like the bugs didn't get to it a little bit. Still getting cooked. Still getting cooked. Yesterday I harvested all the peppers. Or two days ago. So that's good, man. Oh wow, look at that one. Look at you right there. Yeah, yo. Kush. Good kush. So crazy these beans they taste good raw like this ain't no grocery store string bean right here i don't know if you can see the detail up in there this ain't no grocery store shit i get full off this one bean whoa another one another two hey how did i miss you and these the biggest ones of the day this shit can't even fit in the phone. Hold up. <laughs> Yo, I don't know if the phone do them justice. But, like, if I put this beside my head, this shit's about as long as my face. If I put it at my ear, this a big earring. This a big, nah, this, this would be, if this was an earring, right, I put it on my ear. This would hang down, it's touching my, my neck. That's a big ass bean. So yeah, we out here, man. This this give me life right here. This make me excited. Ain't nothing better than smoking some herb and coming out here harvesting these fruits and vegetables. Man, it's like heaven. It's heaven on earth. This is heaven on earth. Got the peppers on trellis now. So I'm expecting a lot more big things from y'all. These peppers right here are hot. I don't like that hot stuff for real, but we got them nonetheless. I need to... I need to sit you up. She just just laid out. Need to be sitting up like this. So she can put out. You see, ain't really no fruit up here. Just this one pepper. Some little ones right there. Not too much happening. But my lettuce is looking real good. This row at least. This row coming up, up. Looking good. This row. You know, what happened on this row? And one, two, three, four, like five maybe. Ain't much happening over here. Yeah, just real quick, man. <sighs> Wake up in the morning, come outside, harvest some vegetables. And we already know we eating good tonight. We ain't got to get in the car. We ain't got to go nowhere. We eating good. All you need is water for these. You boy, these in some water, throw some seasoning on it. You good to go, man. That's half a meal. You know what I'm saying? We cook it up. The peppers, I like to stir fry my, my vegetables, you know what I'm saying? Make um make like tacos, burritos, like how the Mexicans do it. Shout out to Migo, cause I be whipping it up. I learned from them. They know what to do with some vegetables. Like I said earlier, I'm not really eating meat like that. Like, I will from time to time. I eat some fish, some shrimp, you know what I'm saying? Something light. It ain't really gonna weigh on me too heavy. It's not really gonna rob me of all my energy. I like that real light food, like vegetables and fruit. Have me feeling good, mood good, everything good. 
Yeah, I'ma holla at y'all next time.